Von Stein, and this is The Facts. Uh, I'm here tonight with Beth Griffith, Bern Nix, and Andrew Bolotowski, and we're beginning a, a, a series within this series, The Facts, about, um, uh, I, I'm trying to figure out why I lie. Um, I don't lie as much as I used to. I used to lie a lot when I was, uh, I, there were periods of time in my life when I lied a lot, and so this is not a confession, it is an analysis. I'm trying to understand what precipitates these lies, what, why I want to dress up as somebody else, is it just fun? Or, um, or, or, you know, yeah, no. Marianne's clothes. <laughs> Hit it. should try that again but before we try I just want to remind you this remember this was written a, a piece uh, a, a much longer piece about Marianne measles a young woman who was killed in 1997 in Litchfield Connecticut and a 13 year old uh, woman a uh, young girl who was killed by seven people and um, and this was uh, I, I uh, I spent a lot of time working on this piece, thinking about all the characters in it, the, her and the people who killed her. And uh, so this is a piece about Marianne, 13-year-old uh, Marianne, uh, jaunty, angry, happy, uh, confused, uh, excited, uh, Marianne walking down the street and picking out clothes. And I remember when I, w I had a friend at one time um, this, 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 this will really date me, but everything dates me. I have, a, I have, a, I had a friend at one time who, and I don't mind that really. You know what the hell? I had a friend who used to sew her Georgia Brewer. She sewed herself into her pants, mm. and and she showed me how she, you know, I can still remember her on the bed with, the, you know, the, and um, so that kind of fun. So let's hear Marianne's clothes again. I don't think we did. We made that up. Well, Bernie wasn't there, but. When she, when there's nothing written on Oh, okay, oh, okay, okay, okay. I yeah. don't, I forgot that too. Yeah, okay. Okay. So let's hear your cue. Let's hear your uh, cue. We're going to hear the cue. Here we go. <coughs> Thank you. 
that was a little more a little more better. Any problems with that that we should look at? Emotionally honest. <laughs> <laughs> Emotionally honest. Today I heard a guy say on TV that in when the United States leaves Iraq and the United States has built the biggest uh, base in, in the world, biggest embassy in the world in Iraq, in Baghdad, and the United States is leaving 16,000 people there to, to man this, this uh, the um, embassy, the American embassy in Iraq. And, and I don't know if that includes the 5,000 that they're leaving as trainers for the Iraqi army. And eight, half of the people that they're leaving are private contractors. Mm -hmm. And this guy, uh, the guy who was talking about it, uh, juxtaposed that with the um, uh, average number of people that Americans have at an embassy in a country the size of Iraq is 100 to 150. I, I have a really hard time watching the news. Not because such bad things are happening, but because so much of it isn't being told to us. the best portraits of reality. How do they organize my perceptions? Uh, how do they circumscribe my thinking, correct my nerves, redirect my eyes? What do I believe and why do I believe it? Let's try mumbling. Mumbling is about mumbling. <laughs> which uh, seems a, uh, a, a good thing to do some of the time. When you're in, you know, it's better than saying something that's completely untrue, right? I mean, if the, the alternative, do I mumble or do I, uh, do you like working here? Yeah, sure, I love it. <laughs> is it, is it, is, is, is it, um, uh, you know, I don't know. You know what I'm saying. <laughs> okay, so, uh, do you want me to count this off, or mm -hmm. uh, I don't even know if I have it. Oh, yeah, I have it. Do you want me to count? It's in three, four time. Want me to count it off all the way through? Okay. Yeah, yeah. sure. Around here. One, two, three. 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 Problem areas? Were there problem areas? Can we do the last uh, 24? Okay. Three for nothing. One, two, three. 
One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. So, 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 so. But did you have to mumble a lot in one of your jobs recently? Where did this come from? I think they accused me of mumbling. But oh. I, <laughs> I don't think I was. I thought I wasn't, you know. Th that's the other problem, you know. <laughs> I thought it was crystal clear. Sometimes people say they don't understand you when they when actually what it means is that they understand you only too well. They don't want to hear it. God and all, you know, like, like, issue of control, you know, the, the issue of, I mean, that's, I'm afraid to say it, but isn't that what, isn't that what so much of this, you know, all these ideas people about have about how the, well, let me just get some control, oh, well, somebody's watching over me, they've got the controls, and, and, you know, and, and they're going to take care of business for me, so, so, okay, <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm covered. Uh, you do that. <laughs> <laughs> and <laughs> I said, you know, who has the last word? <laughs> um, I think there's this interesting time in, in uh, as I remember my childhood, which is really far away, but I, you know, the, the, this interesting time around three or four when you when you really when you really becoming yourself in 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 in, 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 in well, you've come, become yourself all the way through, but it it, it becomes it becomes. You, you have more and more clashes with the powers that be around you, your parents at that point, and you, 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 you're not this so much a, a cute little thing anymore. And, and I think as I climbed out of my, my childhood, somewhere in there, I, this, this starts this curve of, of removing myself from who I am. And I was doing that, I think, in order to, to, to defend myself and to, to find ways to live in the situation that I was living in. I, I, made, I made these, the fantasies were made to compensate for, to compensate. That must happen to everyone.
calling this thing disentangling the surface. I'm, I, I think like it's like the surface of me is covered with this 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 mask, of, you know, this grill work mask that it, that I just I need to get these parts apart that you know and they're co they're cross reference with each other, so you have to take them all apart to find the person that's actually there. For the last thing, let's try A.J. Walter. So you heard a little about, about Marianne. This is one of the people that ended her life quite cruelly. What do we got here? I saw it there before, Burn. No, it's here, it's here, it's here. Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay, you got it? Everybody got it? I have it. Yeah. Okay. Cue. What's your cue? My cue is bar 22. Oh. No, I shouldn't yes, say that. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Okay, Burn, and I don't think, I don't know if you were here for the last, for us figuring out this I cue. I do it twice, and furthermore, I have to remember that, that I brought enough F sharps <laughs> of town. <coughs> in <Or> Manhattan. <coughs> Bar 22 twice. Yeah. Bar 22 without the, the final eighth note. The in both cases. So as we come out of improvisation, since we've been working on this for quite a while, we come out of improvisation straight into the tune, and so one of the, what we have, we, but we still have to set the tempo, so one of the musicians uh, has the job of setting the cue. We set the cue, we decide what the cue is, and then we practice it so that we can remember this. Why'd you do that? Don't tell people about it. <laughs> or they'll all be wanting their cues, too. Yeah. Can you try be, it, please? They'll yeah. be writing it. <coughs> Thank you. 
To a, I went to a, a meeting, a, a, a political meeting. It was, it was an upsetting meeting, though, and, and, and my mind I went into one of these fantasies, and my mind wandered, and I thought about it later. What was at the meeting? Well, what was at the meeting was uh, uh, there was, I went to, it was supposed to be a, a, a talk by a, some, an eminent a speaker, and, um, and, uh, but I left after an hour and a half because it didn't happen, and the hostess was drunk, the, the host was oblivious, maybe there was a guy who was a, a undercover cop in the room, and, and the section of town was very, and um, so, you know, I didn't want to be there, and I took my way, I took my, my body out and my mind out. I'm, I'm much better. I mean, because often I'm in situations where I have to prove myself, where my, where people I'm talking to for some reason or another are hostile. And it may not even be personal, you know, personally hostile. And, 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 and when, I, when I'm not hitting that constantly, who do you think you are kind of wall, 